God, it was my first year here when we had a, um, a retreat for our faculty where we hammered out our current strategic plan and we made a commitment to become a natural, nationally recognized natural resources program. And at that time, we really just taught environmental law, one class that was related. Um, we now teach 13 related classes and I, I, I know this because I've, I've obviously worked on the curriculum committee and I look around the country to get ideas for courses that we can teach and I don't know that there's any curriculum that can really match the whole realm, particularized you know, energy sources, coal, natural gas, um, climate change aspects of it, environmental law, natural resources, water law we're teaching now, environmental dispute resolution I think might be you know, one of the most unique classes in the country. Um, we're teaching a mineral abstracting class. We're bringing adjuncts in to help teach these. So the opportunities for our students uh, curricularly are fascinating. Obviously, we've got now two moot court teams, energy law and environmental law. We got our natural resource law journal, um, uh, and we have a new certificate program where you can, get a, you can specialize in uh, natural resources, which is, I, the, what, I guess what we found, you know, I think as a faculty, we made a little bit of a leap of faith. You know, we have an incredible geographic opportunity. As far as Virginia goes, we are located where the coal is, where the methane gas is, and actually where, if we ever get any, where the wind turbines would go here in the Appalachian Highlands, um, uh, as well as Virginia being a solar state. Um, but it was a little bit of a leap of faith. You know, we took advantage of that geographic opportunity and our network of, of industry partners and, and government partners. Uh, what I've been so pleased by and a little bit surprised by, I guess, is the appetite that we're seeing from the students for this stuff. They're eating it up. And it's, I don't know, it's because, you know, a handful of them come from coal companies or, or they're just smart enough to realize that there's a sincere future here in a tough, depressed job market. But uh, the appetite is insatiable. They want more. And it's, it's so cool to see them get excited about it. And they do get excited about it. Some of the, some of the fighting, healthy intellectual fighting that goes on in class is, is, you know, makes a professor's heart leap. <laughs>